Women and girls in Afghanistan face ongoing challenges as Taliban authorities continue to impose rules threatening their rights and freedoms. Today, Afghan women in West Michigan were raising their voices at a rally. News 8's Gabrielle Pfeiffer was there and shares their message. No women, no society. A chance for change could be heard in downtown Grand Rapids Saturday. If anything that history's like taught us has been we need to learn to stop any forms of violence taking place. The Taliban has enforced severe restrictions since regaining control of Afghanistan nearly two years ago. Women and girls can hardly work and leave the house. They've also been banned from receiving an education above sixth grade. It's going to be another generation of chaos. We're going to raise another generation that doesn't know Afghan history that doesn't know how to bring economic development to the country. Freshta Tori John is worried for her home country, the place she fled as a teenager. Loved ones tell her it's a nightmare. They have texted and said, we're not able to do anything. People across the world are demonstrating to raise awareness on the issue. One this group hopes the local community will take seriously. We had over 400 families get here, uh, get resettled here in Grand Rapids in West Michigan, and their families are affected by what's happening. And now that there are new Americans here, they are now part of our community. It's really our responsibility to support them.